Yeah, you said that. Ah, <laughs> uh, come here, man. Come here. Come here. While, while the video's already started, come on. Let me finish this video. He sent you up in there. Come on. I know you don't want to be in there. Come on. Bring your ass in here, man. Come on. Ah, oh, you killing me. You want to do a video? with? Come on. I'm going to do an interview with you real quick. You won't be in no trouble. You won't be in no trouble. You won't talk about slapping no parole officers. Let me in the garage. I'm telling you. All right, well, the video will be in the middle where you can barely see anybody's face. They're fine with that. You can't see nobody's so face. So what are we going to do? The video is this, man. The man came by here, and it was high drama. Right. And you know why he came by here. But it was drama. It was right. something, A lot of that was 95% unnecessary. 95% of it was all unnecessary. It was un but it was unnecessary. Yeah. Um... As a man in America, I'm gonna say black, white, Mexican, Chinese, whatever. As a man in America, you've served. You put it like this: you've served your time and you've served your country. Right. Period. Right. Period. I served time for me and everybody else that had served time in my you own. You served your time within your time. Right. And and now I'm gonna give a brief a brief what's up what happened. Okay. So my nephew gets in the car and he's riding with this dude. Right. Dude done did some nefarious shit down the street. And so my nephew's like, what's going on? And dude's like, the police behind me, I'm about to bail. And pretty much you've been locked up and clinked up behind the next motherfucker trying to bail out the car and leave you hanging. Right. So now you're on parole and probation and shit on the humbug. And, you know, things ain't going right since you've been home. I understand that. You know, we, we both know that, right? And, you know, things could be better on everybody's end. Just put it like sure. that on everybody's end. And this motherfucker comes to the house, humbug style. He talks to you. Everything's fine. Right. And comes right back in the house. You're going to jail if you don't give up an address. <laughs> because he already <laughs> felt, you know what I'm saying, that I wasn't here. I know. You know what I'm saying that was his whole dispute. Like I'm gonna catch him not there because I know he's fucking lying to me, mm -hmm. and he had already probably. Well, it's like I'm saying the, pe the people heard him on the video talking. About, You're lying to me, man. You're lying to me. And for somebody to be telling somebody the truth, right? And at any given time, they can take this man on a humbug. Easy. Oh, you look like somebody, or somebody said somebody it looked like you did such and such and such and such. Right. For somebody to have paid that crime, you didn't rape nobody, you didn't kill nobody. Nope. You didn't, wasn't drug related, wasn't no, no violence involved. You got stipulations placed on you that will never allow you to have a regular life. Until I get off of there. Even once you get off. Right. The applications that you put in until it's time will all state that you told the truth. And if you lie and say, no, I never did this, I never did that, and you get a job, and you're doing good at the job, it can be 10 years later, 5 years later, they find that you lied, you lost your shit again. Right. And, you know, so how you deal with a humbug that's going to be weighing over the top of you for 3 years? Well, I kind of seen it today, right? So I'm like, man, damn, I'm really telling the motherfucking truth that I where the hell I done been. You know what I'm saying? And due to the fact that this dude didn't, you know what I'm saying, know me like he should have known me, you know what I'm saying? Because that's his job to get to know his parolees. Mm -hmm. I felt like, damn, man, I'm really, you know what I'm saying, caught up on, you know what I'm saying, this parole or, you know what I'm saying? I'm caught up in the system for real to the point where they can take your life at any moment. Okay, now check this out there. Now, you know what the consequences are to anything. Right. You can be, hey man, you could be, I just had to pee real bad. Right. And I could have ran outside to the front of the house and, and leaned next to the car. Right. That's against the law, you know. It really is. And the anything, police stopped me the other day because yeah. he thought that I was peeing in the bush, right? But I was standing by the bush and I was talking on the phone and he was like bagged up, pulled up in there and was like, hey man, were you just peeing in the bush? And he was like, I'm like, no, I wasn't peeing in the bush. That's what I'm saying. It's like, and he was like, aren't you on parole? And I'm like, yeah. I'm it's like, and how this motherfucker know you're on parole on the humbug? See, they got pictures all up in their cars and shit. You know that, man. Yeah, because they know that I'm finally out. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And due to the fact that I'm out, now they're trying to get used to seeing me and then be able to be like, yeah, he's on parole. See, the, right the, the here, thing man. is this, though. If you go serve your time, like I said, it was nonviolent. Nobody got hurt. Nobody got nothing. And on top of that, it was some 
Hey, and a lot of people gonna think this is racist. What I'm saying. Right. The dude that did all the stealing was white. Right. Yeah, he really was. You was in a white man's car, and he had stolen shit in the car. Right. And you know just well as I do, he didn't do one day in jail. And oh he no, he did time. He got like 14 years. He got 14 he'll years. He'll be out. He'll be out like probably really soon. Got 14, I got like 18 years slash five years. I did like a lot of time. Oh, but 18 like, years? That's too much fucking time. What happened? How the fuck is somebody going to get 18 years for st or something? But yeah, that's how they do it. You know what I mean? If you're black in America and, <laughs> See, you know what I mean? That's the way it goes. He got 14. Well, he's trying to give me a little interview, right? <laughs> this is a little hype trip. It's, the, it's not a hype trip. This is real talk because see, because this can happen to anybody. It really can. But today, I really felt like, damn, yeah, I'm gonna go back to really fucking prison on a fucking humble motherfucking life. And if I start feeling that way, you know what I mean. I'm gonna tell you. But you, I'm you, not you, you gonna, cannot be around anything that will let that motherfucker have a reason to take you. No, home. but the thing about it was, he was already in his mind thought that I wasn't gonna be here. Well, it's he because he figured you were dodging be. him. Yeah, but I'm not dodging him. I don't even give a fuck about him. You know what I mean? Real well, talk. But I know that he's he, he exists. Yeah, you know but, I mean? but but as long as I'm not doing the wrong thing, but he really shows I'm not your friend, and really I don't need you to be. But my I'm going to ask you a question now. You know I mean? If that was your job, no. Now this is off the hook. What I'm going to ask you right now, huh? So well, come on. You finna just, You can come over. You finna roll to the, the garage. You finna roll the dice right now. What? You rolling the dice entirely too goddamn soon. Why? What happened? You not remember we? I'm in the garage. Yeah, you rolling the dice That's too it. soon. I ain't gonna beat you. You still rolling the dice. Run. It's still too soon. Because, you know this motherfucker. This motherfucker Who, here. Shane? Oh, not him. Who? No, 18, fool. Oh, so she hear this motherfucker get loud, because this motherfucker. She ain't gonna get loud. She's not gonna get loud, Alonzo. Oh, let's do it. Let's, okay, look. Let's, we're gonna do this official. We are official. not doing this on let, the computer. Let's do this official. She is not gonna be let's loud. Do, let's, let's do this official. If I get any drama, any stress, that's it. Right. That's, it ain't gonna I be mean, no drama. No, 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 no. All right. There's a history of drama. Okay. Period. Right. If you get any funk or any drama within the next however long, right, you can forget about coming here. Because it ain't gonna be on me because I'm gonna have to tell this person what I agreed to. Right. I'm gonna have to tell this person all kind of shit right. and it's gonna come back on me. Okay, well, if it, it come, gonna... If it come back on me and this person running for you, then your eyes need to be open, and I don't need to hear no more on that subject. Right. But this is still your business. And like I told you, until the motherfucking pull it like and when the pull it like this, until the motherfucker light your ass on fire, right. then you ain't burning. Right. <laughs> you know ain't burning. Ain't and that's the no... deal. That's the deal. But once that match get over here, right. you burnt here. Right. Ain't gonna be no match. Period. Ain't gonna be no bullshit. Ain't gonna be nothing. Right. It ain't gonna be no one. Yeah, no, motherfucker hung up on you. Yeah. Look at that. Hello? Yeah, it ain't gonna be no bullshit, so I mean. Man. Mm. Alright, well, come on. Alright. Oh, man, you're gonna get it. Oh. We ain't gonna get it on Oh, we. Ain't gonna get it on it ain't gonna be we. Okay, it's gonna be me. It's gonna be me. We're gonna get in there anyway, so fuck. Look, if right. she go bad. You know, I, just, bad. I just told white dude he can stay here tonight. Right. He laughed. And he laughing my ass because he, he, he laughing. Laughing. Yeah. because he was gonna stay out there. He was gonna do the work to clean up the yard. So what now kind of work? you got to do the work that I just asked him to do. What kind of work? Because now you just didn't. I told you I was gonna let you do something. What? You jumped on bringing it on now because I thought that that was cool. It wasn't for Are right we now. Live? We oh, live. Don't don't no <laughs> no because look because if I come if I fall in the hole behind this shit right ain't gonna be no hole. Hey, look, 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 look. If y'all want to tune in to see me get kicked up out of where I got to be behind making sure my nephew feel good, oh, <laughs> tune in the next time. Because now I got 30 seconds, and I ain't going to waste it on YouTube. I need to I need to put this 30 seconds on my nephew and um, Cause pass it on. I got to go. Okay. <laughs>